Hello everybody and welcome to this new lesson. In this one I'm gonna show you how to create a workpad. So first of all let's create our text here. So I'm just gonna type type. Okay, I'm gonna validate. Uh, to create a workpad, what you need to do is to come to the type here, right click on it and search for convert create workpad so you come up here and you click and what it does now is that it creates a the working path the path that creates this type here because remember Photoshop when dealing with with type deals with vector type okay so, and vector type has its work path has its path so to to edit this 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 point here this anchor points here what you need to do is to select the direct selection tool here just underneath the text tool and when selecting you can now select any point you want and then modify it but as you see as i modify any point here it doesn't do anything because because this is the text type that still appears so what I can do is hide it and modify my text as I want for, for the moment just do the modification you want to do for example I'm gonna grab this one here this one here I'm gonna grab this one Sorry, and this one I hold holding the shift key on my keyboard to select two points and making it like this. This is this is a good I, I use this a lot to give style to my type here. And once you're happy with your text, what you can do now is right click, go to the path here and as you see we were on the layer tab but you, what you want to do is go to the path tab here right click and make selection just leave to default options click ok and what it does it it selects for you the type you you created you go back to the layer tab and you create a new layer here okay so when creating this new layer what you want to do is of course you need to to have this type selected like this and what you want to do is go to edit fill and here you want to choose a color for your text let's stick with the red for example and as I hit ok then my type here as you see takes form this is a very good tool, a very useful, and I used to use it a lot because it gives me style, as you see, to the type you create. So, thanks for watching this course and see you in the next movie.